Hello learners, welcome to an academy. My name is Manjuri Singh. On this 28th of May 2023, our Honorable Prime Minister inaugurated the new parliament. The foundation stone of new parliament was laid on 10th December 2020, which means it almost took two and a half years to complete this project. It is designed by HCP Design Planning and Management Private Limited, led by architect Pimal Patel. Before starting with the new features of the parliament, let's discuss what Singhal is. Singhal has been installed beside the seat of the Speaker of the Lok Sabha. It comes from the Tamil word Simai, meaning righteousness. It is made of gold carved with Nandi, the bull, which is precious to Lord Shiva. It is considered to be the symbol of transfer of power, justice and good governance. It was presented to the India's first Prime Minister Jawaharlal Nehru on 14th August 1947 to mark the transfer of power from British government to India. Old Parliament is considered to be the Council House. It took six years to construct, that is 1921 to 1927. It was designed by British architects Edward Lutyens and Herbert Baker. The question arises here, why do we need new parliament? Old parliament was not sufficient to fulfill the requirements of today. Therefore, we needed new parliament for which many features we can see in the new parliament. New parliament is located at Central Vista in New Delhi with 3.2 km stretch. It consists of iconic buildings like Rashtrapati Bhavan, North and South Block, India Gate, National Archives, constructed before 1931, the year in which new capital was inaugurated. The area of the new parliament is around 64,500 square meters. The parliament is designed to be secure and efficient, equipped with latest communication technology. The old and new parliament assembled together to facilitate smooth and efficient functioning of the operations of the parliament. This platinum rated green building ensures environmental sustainability. The triangular shape of the new parliament ensures optimum space utilization. This parliament is a combination of diversity in modern India and traditional art and culture. We can see the new addition in this building that is of Constitutional Hall, which symbolizes Indian citizens as the heart of democracy. We can see the Constitutional Gallery, which is easily accessible to public. The banyan tree at the open central courtyard symbolizes the employment opportunities for skilled, semi-skilled and unskilled workers. The two houses of the new parliament has been designed on the theme like Rajya Sabha has been constructed on the theme of the national flower of India, that is Lotus. It consists of 384 sitting capacity. The color combination of the Rajya Sabha can be seen, which, is, which portrays the Lotus. While on the other hand, Lok Sabha is made on the theme of Peacock, that is National Bird of India. The offices and committee rooms are designed with ultra-modern fashion technology. Library gives the superior experience to the members visiting here, while central lounge is intended to be a place for members to interact. The new parliament also has a facility for disabled people, that is, it is Divyang friendly, which make them move freely around the parliament. So this was all about the new features of the parliament which somewhere add on to the old parliament but old parliament will also work together with the new parliament so if you like the video do share with your friends for the knowledge and if you haven't subscribed the channel till now please subscribe thank you so much